Welcome back to my channel. I know it has been a very long time since I posted a video, but I'm back. And as you can tell from the colors and part of my background, that it is Christmas season. So right now I'm filming this video because I immediately got the package. I have been waiting on this package for a very long time. I ordered it on Thanksgiving Day. So if you're wondering what package I am talking about, it is the... Jeffree Star Holiday Mystery Boxes. I've already seen what's in it. I mean, I tried not to, but everybody was literally getting their package before me. And on the day that it launched, for me, I live in Texas, so it's like two hours ahead of California, so I had to wait till two o'clock. But it literally launched five minutes before the time it was supposed to, so I noticed it about maybe... 156 157 whenever I went on the site that it was available and so I was able to get all three boxes if you want please stay tuned to the end of the video because I will be having a, a pretty big giveaway you know if you want to enter you can enter if not it's okay but I hope you guys enjoy the video so let me start opening this big box so first off, I was already disappointed because I was expecting to get the pink box. I've seen other people get the pink box, but for me to get a basic box, it's like, eh, whatever. And as I said, I ordered it on Thanksgiving Day. I did not receive my tracking information until like a week ago. So a week before this was delivered. I want to say like on a Friday. A Friday or a Thursday but um I've been waiting so long it's like everybody was getting theirs before me I was starting to become impatient I was gonna contact customer service but I know Jeffrey was like he's really getting through these boxes and um he was shipping his Black Friday stuff and doing the conspiracy palettes and by the way this is my very first Jeffree Star mystery box I have never owned a box from him but I do own a mirror of his, a powder, two palettes, and I think that's it. I think that's all I own of his. And I'm, I was just really excited to try some of his products, and I think this was the best way for me to try. Um, I know everybody else has talked about it, but basically there was an issue with the mini box. People were upset that on the flyer that it said it would come with one cosmetic item, but instead it came with stickers. I mean, that story's just out there everywhere. Even Jeffrey said it on Snapchat. Somewhere around here, I'll include like a clip or something so you guys can see. People loved my artist Davis from the Shane series, um, and a lot of you really loved his artwork. So I'm like, oh my God, let's do stickers. A lot of people love stickers, and a lot of you, now that this has happened, hey! stickers <laughs> or maybe you don't hate stickers but you hate what happened to get to the sticker moment so advertisement for the mystery boxes the first time you ever posted it said that every box would have one exclusive cosmetics item and i had no idea the flyer said me there's no other way to make it right except refund every single person who bought a mini mystery box but um yeah, I mean, I wasn't disappointed because he basically refunded you the money if you bought the mini box. I mean, it was nothing to really be upset about. So you basically got your money back and still received a free box, you know? So it's, it's no big deal. And inside the box, we have this tissue paper. My order papers in here. Oh, this is so cute. I'm keeping this. So it is Jeffrey and Shane on the card. 
And then on the other side, it is the Conspiracy palette. It looks really nice. At the moment, I wanted the Conspiracy palette because, you know, it was very hyped up and it was a struggle to actually get it. But I never got it in time because, you know, the site was crashing and everybody was on there. So over time, I was like, eh, it's whatever. The main thing that I wanted was the pig mirror because it's actually bigger. And I wanted one of the travel bags because I heard it stores a lot. So I'm just going to, oh, this feels kind of heavy. Pull out all three boxes. Okay. One more box. So here are the holiday boxes. I think it's really cute. So let's just go ahead and start, just like how everybody else starts. I'm gonna do the mini box. And let's see. I actually like the packaging whenever I got this other stuff that I ordered from. What did I order it from? Beauty Bay. I ordered it from Beauty Bay because they had a sale on some of its products. And whenever I ordered my stuff, I actually kept the box because I really, I really like how the box felt, you know? And I even have my box for my mirror. So open it up once again, more tissue paper. I'm actually gonna recycle this tissue paper for Christmas and I'm gonna recycle this box. So everything will be used again. So right off the bat, I see the stickers and I see I have two lip products. So going into the stickers, these are actually really cute. Um, gonna adjust my lighting just a bit because it's getting a little bit too harsh. Okay, a little bit better. So these are what the stickers look like. They're actually pretty cute. Um, I was thinking where I could put these. Normally I put stickers like on my laptop, but I'm thinking maybe on my hard drive is where I'll put my stickers or maybe even just make a phone case out of the stickers. So we're gonna go with this one. This is a lip ammunition and it is in the shade Glazed. It looks really shimmery on the packaging. It probably won't focus, 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 focus. Nope, it's not going to focus. So, ain't no problem. Open it. Looks like this. It's cute how it looks like a little bullet. Pop it off, and it's like this really pretty shimmery gold. And actually, I'm going to just swatch it on the back of my hand. See if I can get a tad bit closer so you guys can see. And that's what it looks like. It's actually... It's not bad. It looks like it's a pinky, yeah, like a iridescent pink, but it's actually gold, like a nice gold eyeshadow. Let me see if I smear. No, it's still going to come out a little pinky. Not a problem whatsoever. Just put it back in the packaging. So the next one that I have is, I don't want to say the name on camera, so we're gonna say Kitty Whipped. And this one is actually like a, it looks pretty golden. These names are, it's outrageous. Oh, okay. So it looks like this, almost like a, I can't even describe the color, like a bronzy type color. And the quality feels really nice. Let me go again. And I'm sorry if these swatches are really bad, but that's how it just comes out. So yeah, it's kind of a, a bronzy, burnt orange kind of color. There you go. You can see it a little better there. Um, I don't hate it. It's, it's fine. If I don't like it as a lipstick, I will most definitely use it as like an eyeshadow or something. I just don't know how I feel about certain colors that are like super bold because that's not for me. Next, we're gonna go into the deluxe. No, this isn't the deluxe, this is the premium, I'm sorry. So the premium, or as other people call it, the medium size box. And as you know, the mini box retailed for, well, you paid $20 and I forgot what it retailed for. I'll probably put it on the side. 
And I know for the premium box, it cost 60. Mm -hmm. And for the deluxe box, which is the bigger box, it cost 100. I was really hoping that the big box would be like the Halloween mystery box. I was a little late to that. I really didn't get like the update. So I had to make sure that I followed Jeffrey and that I followed Jeffree Star Cosmetics on Instagram. So I would know about it. So inside, right off the bat, we have paper again. Just toss this paper to the side. And once again, more stickers. I'll probably put this pack of stickers in my giveaway so other people can have them. I don't need to be greedy and have two. Uh, already, I already know this is a blue blood, blue blood palette and I have it already. So this will be a part of the giveaway. So like I said, just stay tuned in the video and I'll tell you how to enter. It's really easy. So I'm just putting that off to the side. And what's left in here is the liquid frost and two lip products. So one of the lip products is actually the Queen Supreme. Um, it is actually a pink color. I'm not big on pink lipstick, but oh my gosh, it's really in there. I'm sorry, whoever gets it. Oh, it was really stuck in there because on the sides, I don't know if you can tell, but it has like this sticky residue that was stuck on the sides. Um, I'm debating on if I want to give this away or do I want to keep it? Cause it looks like a really fun color. And if I do give it away, I don't want to swatch it. So I'll let you know later what's in the giveaway. The other one is the Mystery Stocking Lipstick. Um, I guess Jeffrey didn't want to name it. So it's just like a stocking with a question mark, which is perfectly fine by me. It is this lovely little red here, but it actually is like a metallic red. Okay, right underneath, and then just, ooh, ooh, ooh. So it's really nice. Um, my swatching is really bad, I'm sorry again, but it's a pretty decent red. Um, a color I can compare it to would be maybe like NARS or a Kylie Cosmetic type of red, but it goes on really smooth. So I would definitely be using this pretty soon. And last but not least, I have the <laughs> liquid frost. I feel like I'm getting the joke box. Like Jeffrey, you're setting me up, okay? Because with these uh, names, this one is called blue balls. So I have liquid frost and blue balls. I've never tried his highlighter. I think the main reason why I got the mystery box was to test his highlighters. So it comes like this. I'm kind of scared of the color because it is blue. You see, I already got like the lipstick on there because it's on my hand. And it's perfectly fine. Okay, so I'm actually gonna use the back of my hand for this. Like the tiniest drop, because I know like a lot of people when they swatch it, it just be like a whole chunk of it. So this there's nothing on my pinky. Ooh. Ooh. I actually like this. It's like a it's really subtle. I'm gonna add a little bit more. Just gonna dab it on there. Cause I really want to intensify it to see what it looks like. Ooh. Okay. Okay, I like it. I can see myself using this. And it's like, like I said, it's really smooth. It's like a creamy type highlighter, but not creamy, creamy, like a light, gentle. Okay, just put this back in the box. So last but not least, we have the deluxe box. I have been dying to this video because, you know, it's Jeffrey. Jeffrey's always coming out with something new. Um, I really did like the way his new highlighter looked. 
the, I believe it's called the Extreme Frost. And I was hesitant on buying it because, I mean, it's, it's $50. But I know he said, like, he wanted you to feel the luxury of the box itself. But the names of it were hilarious. I was saying it to my boyfriend the other night, and he was just like, wow. Because he knows I watch Jeffrey, and I watch Shane, especially throughout the whole documentary. I watch it all the time. So we're going to open. So far, the first thing that I do see is the sweatshirt. Everybody has a sweatshirt. I got mine in a size large. Gonna open it up. So it says Jeffree Star Cosmetics Premium Cosmetic Company Five Year Anniversary Calabasas, California. And then you know on the sleeves you have the signature Jeffree Star. It actually feels really nice, and the inside is soft too. But his detailing is like amazing. He makes sure like, you know, this is his product. Okay. This is what you're getting. And I actually like it. I can see myself wearing it, especially since it's, it's a little chilly right now. But yes, most definitely I am keeping that. Now, everything else in the box that we do have here, I see. Oh, okay. Get rid of this extra paper. We're going to talk about the palette, and then I have a, another set of stickers. I have three stickers, Jeffrey. You must made a lot of stickers because they're in every single one of my box. So I might split my giveaway up for two people and not just one. So that way they won't be stuck with two stickers when I got three. Okay, I'm going to pull out these lip products and talk about these first. So right off the bat, I have the shade Clout. And let's see how it looks. It looks like it's a kind of a purple. Ooh, what? I think I might keep this. Okay, here we go again. I think there's nothing up here, yeah. I'm getting like a whole lot of metallics, which is perfectly fine. It gives me more time to like experience and play with them. It looks really nice. It almost looks like the liquid um, frost, but this is just more of a strong purple, purple metallic tint, while this one is like a light blue with purple flakes or maybe pink flakes in there. But it's a, it's really nice in the shade Clout. And on each box, I don't know if people notice, but it always says shake well before use. Okay, in this next shade, we have Huntington Beach. I don't know um, what collection this is from, but it is a really pretty blue. I'm debating on keeping this one because I've never experimented with blue lipstick. But, um, yeah, you know what? I'll, I'll keep it. It gives me something to play with. Oh, my gosh. It's like a, a teal. Here we go. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, most definitely. I can easily play with this. I love the color. So freaking nice. Okay, and I already know what this is. I'm excited because I don't have this one. So sadly enough, it's not going to be in the giveaway, but there are more great things that are in the giveaway. It is the Jeffree Star Cosmetic Thirsty Palette. So just opening it up. I think they said this is his summer collection. I'm sorry about the light because the light's looking a little harsh. I have a lighting light here and then I have the outside light there. But um, I'm gonna open it up. Oh man, okay, okay. Gotta get you to focus. There we go. So just tilt it back like this. So, 
these are all of the colors. I'm going to swatch them because I think they look really pretty. So I'm not going to swatch all, just some of the colors. So maybe this shade right here, this pretty light blue, it's called Submerge. This is what it looks like on my finger. And oh my God, that's one swipe. I'm living. Quench, because we all know how hard it is to find that perfect yellow. And I think it's, I think this will be a pretty good yellow. I'm just making sure I have enough on my finger. And here we go again. And press and swoop. It's, it's okay. I think if you just build on it a little bit, it could be better. Yeah, you'll just have to build on it. Yeah, it's a really nice shell well. Um, tried to play me with another name that I'm not gonna say on you. Let's do Snatch. Oh, so pretty. So, so pretty. And with most of these, I'm honestly doing one swatch. I may go back over it to intensify the color, but nothing more. Um, I'm going to do stroke, which is also on the top. It looks like this. And boom. Okay. He, he knows what he's doing. I'm going to check out this silvery color in the shade Divine. I can't. Oh, my. I mean, look at that. That's amazing. I told myself after I got the blue blood, blue blood, oh, it's the hardest thing for me to say, the blue blood palette, that I didn't want any other makeup palette because I felt like his palettes were so easy to apply. I didn't have to keep going back into other palettes. I'm a big fan of Jeffrey's with his palettes and his formula that he uses. And I'm also getting into the Anastasia palettes. I have two of the Norvina palettes and I'm obsessed with them. I think they're really great. Every time I've done a look with them out in public, other people complimenting me, I'll probably insert a picture of me with, um, with the palette that I use. And so I also bought a Huda palette on Black Friday and I actually like that. I did try a Kylie palette, but I don't know if it was just because, I don't know, I can't justify the palette. It just, it didn't work for me as well as those other palettes did. So next I go back into the box and I see a candy cane metal straw. And I know the last time that he did the metal straws, people complained like there was no brush with it and there's a brush this time, so no complaints from me, Jeffrey. Honestly, no complaints at all. Um, well, really, there is a tiny complaint. It's just like a little bit of scratching on my... There we go. A little bit of scratching on my straw kit. I mean, I'm not complaining because, you know, that's how it goes sometimes. You get what you pay for. But, I mean, metal straws are in right now, so you're basically paying for the trend. I have no problem doing that whatsoever. The next thing is the Supreme Frost. I'm sorry. Um, it's going to be in the shade Caramel Kiss. I'm always opening it from the bottom because I don't want to ruin the label on the top. Okay, it's cute. It's cute. I'm kind of glad I got this one. Because I know a lot of people have been getting the, um, a lot of people have been getting the green one and I'm hesitant on doing that. So here we go. Let's do a swatch. Yeah, this is a good finger to use. Okay, okay, okay. It is really, it's a really nice feeling, kind of, um, kind of gritty. 
not really gritty, more like you can you can feel the glitter as you you do it, but it's like a light touch of it. Okay, right here, and okay. Now this is a highlighter I could probably use daily. I actually love it. So while I'm already this close, I'm gonna show you the other swatches that I did of the other things. So right now we have the liquid frost that I have in blue balls. We have clout. We have, I forgot this shade, I'm so sorry. This is other shade, this was a mystery shade and this was Huntington Beach. And over here, this was the Thirsty palette. I just wanted you guys to get a look up close because I know my lighting is kind of crazy at the moment. So right now I'm loving all the products that I have. Um, there's nothing like too dramatic or too crazy for me. And the last thing that I saved in the mystery box is, we already know what it is. It's the peppermint, is it called peppermint frost? I know it's peppermint. Yeah, the peppermint frost mystery highlighter. Um, like I said before, I am keeping all my packaging just because I love the way it feels. So it is this with the candy cane stripe, just like the straw. Let me zoom in. Here we go. Just like the straw. So right off the bat, make sure I'm up close and boom. What do you guys think? Do you like it? Do you love it? What's the tea? Okay. So I'm gonna go in and start swatching. The first swatch I'm gonna do is of Ugly Sweater. Ugly Sweater is the very first one with the pink in it. Okay. So right now that is Ugly Sweater. It's kind of um, a little pinky white tone, just like the shade that it is. The other one is Igloo Gold this golden color. So really, I'm actually a little bit heavy handed with this highlighter. So I'm gonna try to be lighter because you might see like a chunks of it in there. And the last one is chocolate ice. And oh, just gonna do this. So that's chocolate ice. And you can actually see a difference with the chocolate ice and right here with the, I think it was caramel. So the caramel and the chocolate ice is a huge difference. It's just a little bit more lighter and it can be blinding. Let me blend it out a little bit. Okay. Just blend it out. Okay, so I blended them out a little bit more so you can actually see. I mean, it's not really bad or anything. It's just, I mean, my swatching is bad with my arms because my arms are crazy right now. But it's, um, it's, it's nice. I don't hate it. I'm surprised there's not like a mirror to go with it right here because all his other, like, palettes have um, mirrors in it. I'm sorry. I was just smelling it. It, it really does smell like peppermint. It smells really nice. So we'll be keeping that too. So if you stayed this long, you wanna know about my giveaway, and I'm also gonna show you the products that will be in the giveaway. Okay, so right off the bat, this is gonna be mystery, but well, basically prize number one. Um, what you're gonna get in here is the Kylie Jenner lipstick. I don't remember what shade this was in. Oh. It's in the shade Coming to Town. It's from her holiday collection. Um, I never opened it, I never used it. I knew the shade just wasn't for me whenever I saw the shade on Kylie. So I included this in the box. You know you will be getting the Blue Blood palette. Um, also, if you know from Kylie's holiday collection, she had um, the high gloss collection and it came in a pack like this. 
So I kept one of the shades and I'm giving the other two away to you guys because I don't want you to think that I've used it or anything. I just went ahead and took out the shade I wanted and then I just left the rest for you guys. Okay, so the high gloss shade that you'll be getting is this red. I figure red and blue, holiday season, very wintry, very festive. Um, I can't get it to focus, but this shade is Wish Come True. And it's like a metallic red kind of gloss. Also, I have these little shimmery, they're not really shimmery, they're more like, um, I can't even describe what they are. But you can add them to your face, you can add them to your eyes to just enhance the look. So this one is stars. This one is some hearts in here. These are more like hearts mixed with stars, mixed with four leaf clovers maybe. And over here, there's also some that are just like Mickey Mouse. And these are pink snowflakes. You're also going to get this nice little bracelet. It's a tree. And it has like, um, like little stones on the inside of it. And you're also getting some of my favorite lashes from Bad Bish Lashes. Um, you get three of them. And they are in the style okra. So we move on to box number two, where you're actually getting the Modern Renaissance palette. I've already had one. Um, whenever I bought the holiday collection, it came with another Modern Renaissance and Soft Glam. So I'm just giving away my Modern Renaissance. You're also getting the Okr shade, well, Okr lashes, I'm sorry, uh, from Babish Lashes. Also, the Kylie High Gloss shade that you're going to get is Must Be Magic. This one is like a gold metallic. And you're also getting a bracelet, and this one is like a rose gold kind of bracelet. The little, I don't know what to call these, but um, this one is Dolphins. These are Playboy Bunnies. These are Flowers. And these last ones are some green hearts. And also, the last thing you will be getting is the Kylie Cosmetics Blush and Highlighter Duo. I never opened it because I don't really wear blush. And the highlighter is just not the shade for me. I could tell from basically Kylie's photos. And you know that you guys will be getting the box to go along with it so you can experience it. If I can, one of these might go in the mini box. Right now, I have the products that I want in the mini box. But, um, so yeah. Let me get to it on how to win these products. Hey guys, sorry I forgot to mention that also what is going to come in these boxes are the Jeffree Star stickers. It wouldn't be a mystery box giveaway if there wasn't any stickers in it. So... If you made it this far, I want to thank you. Um, let's just go ahead and get into the giveaway rules so we can close out this video. What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Um, so, number one, you have to be subscribed to my channel and subscribe to my couples channel. It'll all be linked down below. Number two, you have to follow me on Instagram. It's very important for you to follow me on Instagram because it goes to rule number three. Rule number three is comment here on YouTube which box you would like to receive and on Instagram I'm going to post a photo of the box and then you're going to comment which box you want from there because I'll be choosing a winner from YouTube and one from Instagram and that's it that's all you have to do it's no big deal just remember to one follow me well basically subscribe to me and subscribe to my couples channel two follow me on Instagram and three, comment on this video, which box you want, and do the same for Instagram. Comment on the photo for which box you want. That's it, and if you're confused about any of it, it'll all be in the description box down below. So I wanna thank you guys for staying tuned, and guess I'll see you next time.